Hey guys, and welcome back to Devil's Third. When we last left off, uh, we found out that the world's basically been nuked back into oblivion, and the good old president of the USA has let us out of um, <laughs> our 800-year sentence to go track down some of our old friends who have plunged the world into darkness. So, let's get in on that. Also, the enemy seems to be using chemical warfare. Which is not fun, but luckily we are immune, so hey, it's all gravy, baby. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Flame on, motherfucker. Oof, nice. And you can see straight off the bat the fact that the frame rate is literally through the floor. Oh, we've got the katana. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Oh, hey, guys. Now, do we have any explosives? We do. Get some nades out there. Ooh. 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 Yes. That's what we're talking about. So, chemical warfare. Let's go see what Big Mouse has been up to all this time. Um, okay. Well, I mean, that was a nice look at the inside of a truck there. Luckily, these guys aren't the hardest enemies known to man. Alright, let's go grab some loot. We also want to have a look around because there are six collectibles on each mission. Uh, we also have this pistol here, which is awful. Truly awful weapon. Really hard to actually even aim, so we're going to just grab an enemy weapon. This thing's pretty badass. Oh, can we? Tight. Who's Stella, dug in tight? Who's dug in tight? Take me a minute to get through here. Copy. Confirm your location. Hey, it's a Jesus wagon. Oh my god, look at those textures. Definitely seen better stuff on a PlayStation 2. Absolutely. Whoa, they are dug in tight, aren't they? Well, here comes the airstrike. Luckily, these guys can't aim for shit, so there is that. I thought he was getting an airstrike. Oh, there we go. Whoa. That's what we're talking about. Right, let's get you done. Ooh, pin you to the wall. Not bad. Ooh. Oh, I like it. Man, you know, it would be nice to see them bring this game back, maybe on the Switch. Try and clean that frame rate up, but that's very unlikely, as Nintendo was not happy with this game at all. And, you know, this game actually brought the overall rating of Nintendo, ooh, Nintendo's games down by quite a considerable amount. Hey, friends. Need assistance? You always need assistance, you guys. Oh, definitely going to take the rocket launcher. Whoa, holy shit. Right, let's get some fucking rockets down here. Jesus, smoke the targets. You're smoking my frame rate. Oh, jeez, Louise. Oh, God, right, let's get some cover. Oh, yeah. As you can see, just the choppiness of this game make it so difficult to play really isn't easy right let's hold on to that take the barrels out red barrels is always the way forwards what have we got i got a motherfucker there with the rocket launcher he can get fucked anybody else oh hey guys I could have sworn i put an rpg over there no matter um do we want the lmgs are cool but they're really fucking hard to aim, as you would imagine. But hey, you know what? Let's go with an LMG. All right, boys. What's going on down here? Wow, you've got machete. Is that standard standard equipment? I guess so. Brutal. <laughs> oh, dude. If only we could ride that. Uh, I guess not. The game probably Hurry couldn't handle it anyway. Point. Yeah, we're hurrying. Don't worry. Now, one... 
thing that always cracks you up as well about the frame rate is when you're using the heavy machine guns, they sound more like rifles, to be honest. Oh, God, it's so hard. It's so hard to aim. That's going to be like my... My sentiment all the way through this. Oh, God. Yeah, we're shredding the turret. Don't worry. Let's keep these RPGs loaded. What I like about the RPG is it's not a special weapon either. So every time you restock on ammo, it restocks the uh, RPG too. So and you can hold five rounds for it as well, which is nice. Uh, you know... Nah, we're going to hold on to that, I think. Okay. Alright, come on, boys. Let's go. Oof. Oof. Oh, he's coming in hot. Oh, God. Get clear of the Osprey. Her fuel tanks could blow. Is there a way around the crash site? You should be able to reach the backyard to the second floor of this building. Yeah, now, the Osprey's toast. Not any goodies around here. Doesn't look like it. All right, let's go, boys. Link up with Zulu at the plaza. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're on it. Oh, hello. We're on it. We're on it. So I take it with some kind of rock star or something as well, because, you know, we're playing the drums. We've got guitars everywhere. The president of the old US of A is, is teasing us with Ivan the Terrible, which appears to be some kind of guitar. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, this was also meant to be a trilogy of games as well. Yeah, and you can see there's like the same three dead um, NPCs. Which is also kind of poor. Uh, dude, you gonna you gonna open the door for me? There we go. Fucking hell. I don't know if it was loading or what. Ooh. Hello. Another trophy there. Missed that. Right, come on, man. Now, this I find strange because you can't actually jump over this barrier and get stuck into the fight. It's. Yeah, not really sure what's going on with that, but hey, it is what it is, I guess. Now, this fight is especially difficult. essentially again because of the frame rate the enemies themselves are actually fairly trivial to put down oh god we got armor we got armor coming in mm. we got a dude with a javelin well daniel has died what about the guy that was shooting daniel can we actually kill him I guess that might have killed him. Right, let's put the javelin to work, shall we? Rock it away. Now, I actually kind of like the big jet of uh, smoke that comes out the back of this thing. It looks really cool. They did. Well, I would say they tried, but I, I don't know if they actually really did try. <laughs> Does that sound like a somebody burning to death? Sounds like someone phoning in their performance. This way, come right, on up. let's go check out the castle. Well, I guess we've put the javelin down. That's a shame. Um, right, what do we have here? We've still got a katana, which is nice. Now, you can, as we've seen, you can pick up other weapons. But the katana is just such a cool weapon. Might as well keep to that for now. Until they take it away from us. Which they may or may not, I'm not sure. 
Uh, now, is there any goodies, any pickups around here? We can't uh, destroy anything. Yeah, the environment is non-interactable, like, at all. There's nothing you can do. You can't destroy anything. Um, you know... I love my uh, heavy weapons in games. I really do, but... They just, they don't feel good in this. So, I think we're going to go with that. Uh, machete. Nah, fuck the machete. That guy there's like died in a very unfortunate position. It's like he's sucking his own cock. Let's get out of it. Oh, this, but you look at the graphics. Look at like, oh. I mean, even for the, I mean, it's the Wii U, so you're setting your expectations really fucking low to start with. But even for the Wii U, it's it's rough. It's so rough. Oh, we can actually destroy that. So vehicles you can uh, interact with and destroy, but that's it. Another Jesus wagon there. Jesus mobile. Caution, God on board. Okay, let's go. This is Team Gulf. That tanker is under enemy control. We're heading toward the canal lock gate to take it out. Tanker under enemy control, eh? Alright. Why would you pick the pipe up when you've got a freaking katana? Well, different strokes for different folks, I guess. Oh, hello. Let's get some fucking grenades out there. Oh, oh God. Jesus. My kingdom for some frames. I wonder how well that actually came out on camera. Like, literally, I think that entire exchange there, we had about six frames. But how they actually thought this was acceptable to release this like this, I, you know, I don't know. Oh, hey, buddy, you like to play with knives? I have a big knife. Um, now, I don't know, should we play with the sniper rifle? I've never used a sniper rifle in this game. Oh, God, I can't imagine it being good. But we shall see. And now this weapon is cool. Because this weapon has a flamethrower attached. The only problem with using the flamethrower is it tanks the frame rate. Well, just, you know, moving in this game tanks the frame rate, so it's not really surprising, is it? Uh, anything behind us? No. I probably will go through this to get all the collectibles. I mean, there's absolutely some fun to be had here. Oof. I got your back! I got your back! <laughs> what are they doing? Well, we're having a smoke, but, I mean, what's the AI doing? I have no idea. Literally, I have a fucking clip. Oh, God, flame for it. No, on that. Alright, where are they? You can see this, this cover system as well. It's just absolute dog shit. Oof, there we go. I mean, it... It works. It is nice when your weapons work. So there's that. Oh, God, that's hard to aim. Oh, that's so hard to aim. Oh, no. Right, he's gone. Well, let's get some of that health back. Have a ciggy, mate. There you go. Feel better, bro? Ooh. Wait. Oh, we got, like, some US goons. Listen to that rifle. It sounds like a cap gun. Whoa! Okay, that could have been bad. Alright, let's go. Let's just push up. Fuck this noise. Oh, hey guys! Just, whoa! Just standing there, around the corner, doing sweet FA. 
Ivan's most beloved drink is single cast bourbon. You would have thought it's vodka. I mean, you might as well go the whole hog in this uh, stereotypical video game. Definitely should have been vodka. All right, let's try that again. Now, I will say one thing. The game is incredibly generous with its checkpoints. Like, they're everywhere, man. Which is good. Because you can, as you've just seen, like, if you don't know what you're doing, or you've never played, you know, a certain section before, you can just literally walk around a corner and die. Oh, my God. And these RPG guys really suck. Good thing they're rare. <laughs> oh, wait. No, they're not. They're everywhere. Right, let's go slice this motherfucker gizzard out. There we go. Oof. Looks like they've done some damage here. Damn. Wow. Ooh. Even the cutscenes like lag up though. That's the thing. I'm here, Stella. The AC-130 is clear for airstrikes. Well, here come the airstrikes. Looks like we've got some havoc stock down there. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Jesus. The Wii U's just gonna overheat in a minute. Let overheat and cook itself. It's trying its best, damn it. Uh, as I said, it's not this game isn't the Wii U's fault. It's just or the performance. Oof. Impossible. It goes there. Pile of dead children. Pretty extreme for a Nintendo published game. The mission here was to sweep for insurgents. This town has been infested like rats. You had to fumigate, <laughs> then burn them in their nest. Those kids <laughs> in the hospital, were they terrorists? <laughs> Kill them where they're young, cabrón. Oof. That's actually really heavy. I'm out of here. Well, he's a deserter. Shoot him. So C4 was his friend. Vamos! But somehow got killed? But apparently didn't. Thank you. 
So our friend Ivan lost his friend C4. And then we got snagged by the UN for being a terrorist, which is how we landed up in jail. Okay, we're all up to speed so far. Ivan, are you all right? Yeah, I just ran into one of my former students. Her code name is C4. I put the tracking bullet into her. This is all too familiar. I'm sure the same specialist is behind it. He calls himself Big Mouse. He likes his ciggies, doesn't he? Now, what I do think is pretty cool about the US soldiers in this is they're wearing those exoskeleton suits, which is nice. Not really sure what year this game's set in, but it is at least into the distant, uh, the near future. Well, okay then. So, we've got any goodies around here? It doesn't look like it. Nope. The whole area has just been trashed. Ah, uh, oh, the tomahawks. You know what? We will take the tomahawks. These things are pretty fucking badass. Um. Yeah, let's go for the shotgun. Oh, God. We're being fucked. Right. Oh, hey, guys. Didn't even see these guys there. Well, they can get fucked. Let's grab the shotgun, because why not? I don't know if the shotgun's any good in this game. I'm going to say it's probably not. You know. None of the weapons are really that... Oh, hello. Didn't even see you there, you fucking son of a bitch. Oh, yeah, boy. I love me the tomahawks. They're so much fun. Where are you running to, pussy? Oi! Oi! It's enough of your little Nancy... Fucking twinkle foot in around, boy. Regular little twinkle foot, honestly. Oh god. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. That shotgun is awful. But hey, it is what it is, alright? It is what it is. Let's go. Nice. These guys have, like, machetes and all sorts. And we can almost use our super power thing. What the fuck was that? I haven't seen them do that before. That's pretty cool. Right, let's go Super Saiyan. Not sure what this actually does. There's a floating gun there. That's, that's always cool. We like it when guns float around in space. But, yeah, I mean, this really is a PlayStation 2 game. It really is. You know, people throw that sort of terminology around quite a lot. Oh, this game, this game looks like a PlayStation 1 game. But, no, this really does look like a PS2 or Xbox, uh, OG Xbox game. It really does. All right, anyway, let's go slice and dice. Hey, motherfucker. There we go. Got what was coming to... Oh, God. Frame rate. <laughs> Frame rate. Oh, that was awful. Yeah, that seems to happen a lot in this game. Be careful of vehicles on fire. They are liable to explode. Okay, so I guess as soon as they start burning, that is the indicator that they're going to explode soon. All right. Right, let's try that again. Unfortunately, we still do have the shotgun. The shotgun that's just terrible. I mean, you know, it popped his skull off there. So, that's the thing. All right, let's get some nades. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, it's so bad. 
See, if this game came out on the PC, at least you could brute force it with uh, high-end hardware. But unfortunately, with a console game, it is what it is, you know? Unless we get, like, some kind of remake, which, let's be honest, no. Not gonna happen, like, ever. We are just stuck with it as it is. <laughs> I like the way it doesn't really matter what you shoot at. You just shoot at their legs. Enemy unit. Okay, big mouse in the church. Got you. So, yeah, you can just shoot them in the head. Uh, shoot them in the legs, for instance. And somehow their head the falls off. Okay, is there any way of actually saving that guy? Don't bring a... Oh, God. See it just stutter and sputter. Oh my god. Oh, look at the tattoos when you look at them at a weird angle. They just go flat. Oh god. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. We'll manage. We'll persevere. Every time you turn a corner. Oh god. It's interesting, though, to see the flack that Cyberpunk's getting. But this game was hyped. Okay, it wasn't even in the same league. But this is... This is just is not acceptable at all. Under any stretch of the imagination. Is this an acceptable level performance? Okay. This guy's like, he's not even doing anything. He's just standing there. I think it's kind of silly. Ooh, baby, a triple. Really, dude? You're just going to stand there? Got a generator here. Well, we've got generators everywhere. Looks like they made about five assets. Yeah, another one there. They made about five assets for this game. And they just reused them all over. Right, okay. So we have any ammo knocking about? Uh, I guess we'll go for that one. Just so we've got some bullets. Oh, right. There's a whole fucking sack of ammo here. Um, shotgun? Yeah, you know what? Why not? Oof. This guy just looks <laughs> ridiculous. You cannot pray for your soul. It's far too late. While we were sacrificing our lives, what were you doing? Luxuriating in idleness, surrounded by base pleasures. Complete heresy, the height of decadence. Oof. I know all about it. Do you now? Oh shit! Uh, frames? Can I have some frames, please? This is actually silly. Wow, what is the timer on those nades? Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Like, can you imagine how they did this in development? They're like, you know how the engine struggles when there's two enemies on the screen? Yeah. Why don't we have a boss where we put a thousand enemies on the screen? Let's make that engine really struggle and buckle under the pressure. That's how we shall inflate some kind of artificial difficulty. I mean, it's a weird flex and it's a different technique of pushing the difficulty up. But hey, I guess it worked. Well, maybe it didn't work. Oh, God. Shit. Yep. Oh, man. We just completely locked in place by lag. Oh, dude. Oh, I mean... Okay. Well, we got a checkpoint there, at least, I suppose. Can't really complain at that. 
Really, this is the boss? Like, dude. I mean, he's going on about us surrounded by simple base pleasures, blah, blah, blah. You know, blowing it out of his arsehole. Ouch. And here this sod is, dressed up to his ass in snake leather boots. Is that it? Even a snake leather hat and jacket? I mean, that's pretty luxurious. Base pleasures. Uh, he's done now. Your beloved homeland. Your countrymen destroyed. Big mouse. Your pretty little student. Infected with biotoxin. Biotoxin. You had ideals once. You had honor. But now, you're nothing more than a Yankee errand boy. Where's the honor in killing children, though? And civilians, for that matter. There is no salvation here for a traitor. Only a death. Uh... The fuck is that? Apart from another way to cripple the freight- What the hell? He's got William Birkin on us. Oh shit! Fuck this noise. Oof. 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 Damn, he's gone like- He's a mixture of Hulk and William Birkin. Run! Run! Uh, we need some ammo or something. There's a fire axe. We have some bullets, please. Oh, I suppose. We've got a shotgun, I guess. Whoa! Hot stuff coming through. Yeah, this is more like it. Now he's not really taking much damage. Oof. Oh, God. Ow. My face. My beautiful face. Ah, Jesus Christ. That's more like it. Yes, hit me again. Yeah, we, we're running out of ammo here. Oh, big boy. Come on. Oh, God. That hurt. Luckily. Oof. Okay. So when he jumps at us, we just instantly implode into thousands of chunks. Got ya. Still trying to get used to the dodge system. Or lack thereof, really. Ooh, God. See him just come out of fucking nowhere. We just got, like, all of our ammo back as well. I think we just got all of our ammo back. Which, as well as... Okay, so sometimes... Sometimes when he charges, he has to have a breather. And, you know, rest. Sometimes he doesn't. Not really sure the science behind that. Although, I'm not exactly a scientist, so. Not like this fella. Alright, come on. Either attack me or don't, dude. Alright, that seems to work. Yeah, see, most of the time. Most of the time, once he's finished charging, he has a little rest, a little break. But sometimes it seems to glitch out and he instantly attacks you straight away. Oof. Almost lost me teeth. Uh, now is he down? Wow, his face looks like leather too. The canal in ruins. The city destroyed. Uh, cursed for a hundred years. <laughs> Wait, what's what's cursed for a hundred years? You are or the canal's cursed for a hundred years? Hmm. Okay. I don't think he knows what he's talking about either.
Most enemies are vulnerable to headshots. Bullshit. I've shot plenty of enemies in the head and nothing happens. The situation is deteriorating. Remaining U.S. forces have been deployed to homeland defense. And with the Panama and Suez Canal shut down, our fleets are paralyzed. If the enemy blockades sea trade lanes, we're risking a global food crisis, followed by revolution and anarchy. We need to get to their leadership. If the tracking bullet I put into C4 works, we should be able to locate the enemy. We're already tracking her. It looks like she's headed for the Brat Islands. Since Russia signed the Economic Development Treaty with the U.S. and Japan, there's been a lot of activity on this particular island. But without satellite intel, I can't give you a detailed sit rep. Just drop my boys in. We'll take care of business. You'll work with Ivan. Your team will begin operations at the U.S. military base on Starry Broad Island. Caraway out. Starry Broad Island. Interesting. I'm pretty sure you pull a glory hogging stunt like planes meant to have textures and you might be the one man left behind. Do you understand me? <laughs> He's still got his mum's scarf I just at least. The signal. They must have found the tracking bullet. Uh, <laughs> textures? Anywhere? Ooh, we got some big boy Sams. Oof, that's cool. Hey, we're packing our own hellfires, apparently. I do like those exoskeleton suits that they're wearing. They're cool. Well, looks like we're manning the gun, boys. But that's going to have to wait till the next video. So, we managed to kill Big Mouse. Um, okay, I kind of thought he was going to be a lot further on in the game. But I guess not. I guess when we come back, guys, we're going to... Do this turret section. Although somehow we've just been shot down in an AC-130 and we're, we're totally fine. It's, it's all gravy, baby. It's all gravy. It's that delicious, cheesy gravy stuff that we, we seem to not get a lot. Not. Yeah. Man, my brain's gone to shit today. We don't seem to get a lot of games with this kind of cheesy uh, 80s action style anymore, do we? So uh, it's just a shame that this one wasn't yeah, a little bit better. A little bit better optimized. It could have kept the same sort of horrible, shitty graphics if it just played fluidly. I, I think we could have overlooked that. But anyway, till next time, guys.